Hello everyone, today we are going to explore another wonderful AI feature of Adobe Illustrator and that is to identify the unknown fonts. You may have come across in your design projects in which you do not have an idea about the font that are used in the document and you find great difficulty, face great difficulty in finding out the exact fonts and then download it and then save it and it consumes a great amount of time. So what Adobe has done, Adobe has made life easier for us. So as you can see in this example that this is a flyer that is in the raster format. This is a JPG, JPG image and let's suppose I do not know the font of this title that is the business seminar. So what I need to do, just make the selection, go to window and from here you will see retype beta so this is the retype beta feature that we will be using to find out the unknown fonts used in the document and just click enter so it will import the selection in this feature and as you click on the different text it has the capability to identify each and every font and will provide you the exact same font or similar options that you can simply activate and use in your designing projects so just for now we are using this business title and as soon as we click on this title you can see that adobe has provided us different similar fonts that are that can be used and the first one seems to be the most closest so what we need to do just double click on it so as soon as you click or double click on it so it will it will have the capability to transform it into live text so when you click on exit this is completely live text you can write anything that you want here just write here so that is the great feature of adobe illustrator and that will surely going to save a great amount of time for our for designers like us so we can also select another option so basically this was the font that was already in the system so we didn't have to activate but let's try one more time let's suppose i want to change the font of this seminar so you can see that it has suggested to use the font nuxa next standard compact bold and here you can see that this font is not installed in our system so it but it is available in adobe library so when you click on click to activate it will take some time to activate and here you can see that it has activated the font the procedure will be same just double click on it so it will convert it into live text and as soon as you click on exit you will be able to type anything you want let's suppose we can type webinar we can easily change the color while maintaining the style of the same fonts so that is a game changing feature in adobe illustrator